Welcome to Golf Life, a show focused on your golf lifestyle. What's up, everybody? Welcome to Golf Life. I'm Colt. That's Alyssa. Alyssa, you're in a pretty sweet spot right now. I am. I'm at the Grand Golf Club at the Fairmont Grand Del Mar. For the better part of the United States, we are officially in the 2021 golf season, and that feels amazing. Yes, we are. I'm very excited for the 2021 golf season, and we have a very special preseason show for you this month filled with golf tips, training aids, products and features that will get your game going in the right direction. We show off the brand new Hanma GS line of golf clubs, plus we take a trip to Top Golf to highlight the instruction and practice capabilities that they have to offer. And then we dive into training aid and fitness kit from golfgrade.com and we go one on one with the co-founder of Surf and Turf Golf. But first, in order to lower those scores, you have to have a good short game. That's why we talked to top teacher Sean Cox about the importance of short game practice. That's right, let's go check it out. Joining us here on Golf Live is a great friend of ours, Sean Cox, the director of golf at the Grand Golf Club at the Fairmont Grand Del Mar. Sean, appreciate you joining us. Sean, you've worked with a lot of golfers, worked with a lot of students. We're in the winter months across the country, getting ready for that 2021 season. What are some tips or advice you would give just a regular golfer to get their game in the right spot? So we're all excited in the industry that you're playing more golf. But I'm seeing more people with tendonitis, sore backs, and golfers, professional golfers, they train off the course so they can play better golf. You need to see a trainer, maybe take a yoga class, put something back into your body so that it can help you perform better on the golf course. And then the second part is our expectation for scoring is much higher. And so how do we score better? We have to have a better short game. So you need to work on your short game and hopefully my tip will help you with your short game. Yeah, we caught up with Sean at the, the putting green to learn a little bit about short game. Let's go check it out. Are you struggling with contact around the greens with your short game shots? There could be a reason for that. You could be confusing a tip that you got for your putting with your short game. So when you putt, you were told to keep your head very still. You'd hit the putt, you'd hold the finish, you'd swivel your head. You were told not to raise up. That would be a bad thing. Now when we come to our short game shots, you get a little bit confused. You think that you're supposed to keep your head down. So you try to keep your head from raising up and what happens is you can't get your body through the shot. If you pay attention to my head here, I'm gonna grab this ball and a lot of us have been told the short game is very much like throwing a ball underhand. Well, if I throw this ball underhand and I try to keep my head still, I can't really get my body through by keeping my head down. Naturally, if I was going to throw this ball underhand, I would naturally let my head raise up as I came through the shot. It's the same thing that should happen in your short game. When I'm coming through the shot, because my chest needs to rotate open to make good contact with the ball, the chest rotating open will naturally pull my head naturally up and out of the shot. Obviously, that timing of that is important. It's happening right as you're striking the ball, you're starting to raise up through the shot. You're not trying to keep your head down like this. Again, that blocks your shot. So watch me as I swing through here. I'm going to let my head naturally come through the shot. And I'm a lot taller here than I was when I set up. Here's my setup position and here's my finish position. So remember, do not confuse, keep your head down with your short game. Fat scooters and their single rider vehicles have been a popular mode of transportation on the golf course. It's a fun, fast paced way to get around all 18. We caught up with two golf courses here in Colorado to hear what they thought of the fat scooters as they tested them out for their courses. Today was my first time on a fat scooter or any type of a uh, vehicle like this. It was fun. It was pretty easy to kind of figure out. The throttle system worked easy, but once I got that comfort level down, then, you know, going up and down hills or making turns was fairly easy, and it'd be a lot of fun out on a golf course for 18 holes. It was uh, very exciting. It was fun. You know, a little hesitation at first, trying to get the feel for it, and, and trusting that when you're leaning, making turns, and going up a hill that it's there and supports you and it does you know especially when you're going down hills it's a it was a fun experience the expectation is that the golf course is in perfect condition so if we can you know limit the amount of uh, heavy vehicles out there golf carts out there to a single rider vehicle like this we're all about it 
It's all about making sure the golf course is in the best shape it can be each and every time you go out and play it. I've not ridden bikes in my lifetime and got fairly comfortable in the parking lot and didn't put it on the side driving up and down this ninth fairway, which was a good thing. The impact on the turf, or I should say maybe the lack of impact to the, to the turf is, is quite appealing to uh, the golf industry, I would say. It's a lot of fun. The more fun you can have on a go golf course, the better. It handles really well, especially up that hill. I just wanted to see if, how fast it could go and it, it held its own. So I liked it a lot. When we return, we dive into the brand new GS line of golf clubs for both men and women from Hanma Golf. And we take you around Top Golf Thornton and show you some ways you can get better at golf in an awesome environment. Yeah, I'm Ken Duke, and I've been known for being one of the best drivers of the golf ball on the PGA Tour for the last 10 to 15 years, and now on the PGA Tour Champions. And one big success, I think, is the Survivor T. With the center prong technology, the ball sets up, and it gives me that consistent flight when it comes off the club face. The ball rolls out a lot more, and I've gained at least 10 to 15 yards longer off the tee shots. And for me, getting a little bit older, we all need that, right? There's times that you want to spin on the golf ball, and sometimes you don't. And off the driver, you do not. You want that ball to really roll out. Yeah, I've tried the wooden tees on the launch monitor and the survivor tee, and this one comes off at least 1,000 RPMs lower spin. The durability and the way the ball just comes off the tee, it's a great feeling. We all need a little more distance, and this survivor tee with this center prong technology, it's the ticket. Survivor Golf Tee is now available at Walmart and online at walmart.com. The new Hanma GS golf clubs are game improving with some serious tech, and they will get your ball going farther and straighter from driver to wedge. And here's Mike Billingsley to tell you more. I want to tell you about the new Hanma T-World GS. That stands for gain speed. This is the driver. I'm going to take you through the full set quickly. This is an amazing new technology that has game improvement across the board. You have the flip slot, which is going to give tons of speed on this variable face, so you're going to get great performance and recovery on shots. You also have this keel sole that gets a deeper CG with a weight adjustment that you can customize this driver to your fit in the ladies and the men's line. What's also cool is it has a non-rotating hosel. And what that means is that you can adjust the lie and the loft of the club without changing the graphics on your graphite shaft or your grips. It's a beautiful technology. You should check this out in that driver. Get in and get a demo and then try out their hybrids and their fairways. This also has the flip slot, the faster face, has a really cool alignment feature that sets you up for an inside out approach at the ball. And finally, with their irons, this is a deep cavity back on both the women's and men's line of the irons. It has the flip slot, and that gives you that amazing ball speed off the face, a lot of control, and a lot of forgiveness. And it's a variable set, so it's set up so that your higher irons are going to get you boring flight, whereas your lower irons are going to create the spin that you need to hold the greens and hit higher, better shots into the greens for game improvement. And the graphite shafts, if you've not tried Hanma, their graphite is as good as anybody in the game. If you'd like to gain speed and improve your game, head over to HanmaGolf.com. They've got fitters across the country that can get you set up with a full set of the new GS line today. We met up with Director of Operations, Denon Van Wagner at Top Golf Thornton to show you different ways you can practice your game at a Top Golf location. Dennis. Colt, what's going on? Welcome to Top Golf Thornton. Thanks for having us. Dennis is the Director of Operations here at Top Golf Thornton. Understandably, people come to Top Golf for the great atmosphere, the golf, maybe even the game. But what people may not know or may not have experienced is the different options to play golf, learn golf, and experience golf. So true, Colton. We have something for everyone here at Top Golf. Whether you're a first time golfer or you're the golfer looking to improve their game, we've got what you're looking for. Why don't we take a tour so I can show you around? Let's go. So Top Golf gives golfers an opportunity for golf instruction and golf playing, right? Correct. Because every Top Golf has a PGA professional here to teach or have groups like this playing. Yeah, that's absolutely right. Uh, we have golfers practicing their game. Each of our venues has a uh, PGA certified pro on staff 
Uh, we have a fabulous pro here by the name of Kevin Flynn. Uh, Kevin also does uh, group lessons as well. Then you also have opportunities in the cold weather states like Colorado for golfers like this to come out and, and hit balls in practice when their rounds get canceled. Exactly, and we're really thrilled that we're able to offer that opportunity. When you don't have an opportunity to get on a green grass golf course because it's snowed out, you can come to Top Golf and save that round of golf for the day. Absolutely. Well, let's go have some more fun. Cool. Then, and what's great about Top Golf, and what people may not know, is Top Golf actually stands for Target Oriented Practice. That's correct. Come in here, you can play games, you can actually play virtual courses as well, and work on your game. Without a doubt, we have everything for beginner golfer all the way to golfer that uh, wants to practice their game. So as you can see on our game panel here, there's multiple games for practicing for the golfer. Top score, we've got top chip, top shot. But then as you mentioned, we've also introduced some amazing games for families and for the entertainment group. We have our wonderful Angry Birds game, but I think the thing we're most proud of is these new virtual courses that we feature at Top Golf. Yeah, you have a great, great technology here that actually does a really good job of putting. You can't really, you can't play here, but you guys have come up with that technology to allow you to play. Yeah, absolutely. So our amazing te technology team came up with uh, a single chip shot to either one of our yellow targets to serve as your putt. Then where can people find out more, you know, get in contact with your PGA professional, get some instruction here, or come out and just hit balls? Great question. It's as easy as just going to topgolf.com and selecting one of our venues from the drop down menu, one of our 60 venues in the U.S. to visit. Then I appreciate it. Thank you. Our pleasure. Alyssa is living her best golf life. We caught up with her inside the ropes at the Farmers Insurance Open and get behind the scenes look of what a day or days looks like with Alyssa Kesar. Hey guys, Alyssa Kesar here at New Lady Golfer on Instagram and this week I'm at the beautiful Torrey Pines. We're at the Farmers Insurance Open where I am the social media host and I'm gonna be taking you inside the ropes and behind the scenes to give you a look into my golf life. So it's the day after the Farmers Insurance Open. It was such a great tournament. I had an awesome time hosting and being there for the fans. And now today, I get to play. So I'm out here on the third hole at Torrey South. This is the Pro Tee Box. And I'm gonna play it from here. Let's see how I can do. So it's coming down into the twilight hours. It's been an amazing day getting to play this course after the tournament in the tournament conditions. And I'm just so grateful. I've had a great week. And thank you for joining me behind the scenes in my golf life. Next on Golf Life, we highlight two products, Power Package Golf, a swing aid to get you in the right spots in your swing, and Fit Kit, a portable fitness kit that you can do anywhere to improve strength, flexibility, and balance. Looking for a fast, easy way to lock a powerful, accurate swing into muscle memory? The Swing Jacket guides you through each swing so you feel how the swing is supposed to feel, shot after shot. I'm working on keeping my arms more connected to me, so it definitely helps with that because it doesn't let you get away. I'm struggling a lot with alignment and keeping like my body and my arms all together so that my hips are moving with my arms all at the same time. You know, it's. When they get out of sync, it goes this way, then it goes this way. I'm looking for that consistency. You know, how can I be consistent? The swing jacket basically solidifies exactly where I need to be. You know, it keeps you together. Just putting the swing jacket on allowed me as a coach to actually have a, a learning experience that I wasn't expecting. You know, so I saw the results myself and how it looked and how it felt in the course where the ball was flying and I was sold. To see the swing jacket in action and learn how it could improve your game, visit swingjacket.com. Sit tight, you'll be on the back nine with Golf Life in a moment. This next segment is brought to you in part by GolfGrade.com. Get exclusive golf product and pricing all in one place. Lower those scores at GolfGrade.com. Let's go out to the Swing Studio at Colorado National Golf Club to see how the power package can help your swing with immediate feedback. 
Hey guys, we're here at Colorado National in the Trackman Swing Studio with our friend Kyle. He's a master fitter for Hanma, plus a teaching professional. Kyle, we're working with the Power Package today. It's a great tool that you can use during the off season to get your swing in the right fields and the right positions for your golf game. Absolutely, you know, one thing I like about the Power Package the most is that you can take it to a golf club, cut it off down towards the head, put the power package on it and still practice inside in the winter if you have limited space. So you can work on your game and come out of the cold season better than you were when you went in. Let's go ahead and set up and we'll, uh, we'll take a couple of swings and work on a couple of things for you just to help and so people can see what the power package can do. Go ahead and swing up to the top of the backswing and stop for me. When you get there, you're gonna feel that connection with those pads on your wrists. We're gonna maintain that connection in slow speed down through impact. And then once you get to impact, I want you to get that golf club going left right away, maintain connection. Let's do that one more time. Go ahead and allow your wrist to cross over each other. There, there okay. we go. That's the release that we're looking for and getting that golf club moving yeah. left, right? Doing, doing this, you know, more speed. More speed. Accuracy, you're, you're, you're gonna hit your target where you want to. The smash factor is gonna go up, right? Absolutely, so you're gonna swing faster with less effort, which equates to better distance, yeah. right? And more fun, right? We all wanna have more fun, that's kind of the idea. Let's try to hit one. I'm gonna use the power package to actually hit a golf ball. Um, and kind of mimic that that motion that you gave me. See, I missed the cups there. There you go. Right. So we can tell from that feedback that your swinging left, your your exit swing was off plane. Right. Right. You you lost connection with your arms on the golf club on the way through. So it is a great way to get that feedback to, to create consistent motion patterns that will enable you to play better golf and have more fun. Get the power package at golfgrade.com. Get the exclusive offer over there, Golf Grade. Kyle, appreciate it. Thanks. Create a more powerful swing, improve range of motion, and build core strength with the Fit Kit. And here's Karen Hart to tell you why she loves this at home golf fitness program. The Fit Kit, the ultimate at home golf fitness program. The Fit Kit is an effective, low impact golf fitness training program that you can do indoors or outdoors and build strength, flexibility, core stability, and balance. The kit consists of a molded golf grip, four resistant bands, two handles, ankle attachment, a door anchor, and an online video training series to help you along the way. Here's fitness model Karn Hart at home with this amazing tool. All right, guys, I'm gonna show you one of my favorite moves that I recommend to improve your core and stability to improve your golf swing. First things first, you're gonna need your door anchor and a door, let's go. Go ahead and attach your golf grip to your resistance band. What you're gonna do is you're gonna start out about this height, go up and across, up and across. Make sure to get those hips turned around so you can start using that power uh, for your golf swing. So once you're done on your dominant side, go ahead and turn around to even it out on the opposite side. It's really important to work out both sides so that you stay nice and even and balanced within your body for your golf swing. So I love the Fit Kit because you can use it outdoor or indoor, especially indoors during the winter months or off season. It's great for any fitness level and with all the attachments that come with it, you're sure to get a good full body workout. If you want to create a more powerful swing, improve range of motion, build core strength, increase distance and prevent injury, head over to golfgrade.com right now for their exclusive offer. Men and women of all ages can now get a golf specific workout in the comfort of their own home with the Fit Kit. Golfgrade.com. Let's go out to the fairway with Derek Nannan to learn how to deal with uneven lies. Hi, I'm Derek Nannan from Eagle Mountain Golf Club in Scottsdale, Arizona. We're here on the 16th hole. And one thing that's very familiar here is you are faced with several uneven lies throughout the round. In this particular one, the ball is well above our feet, even though we're in the fairway. When you have a shorter shot, we're about 100 yards from the green, and I use my sand wedge, and I line my sand wedge up right at the flag, the flight indicator that's on my club tells us that the ball's gonna go about right where the white tip is facing, and in this case, it's gonna go out of bounds to the left. One adjustment you wanna use is to go with a lower lofted club. In this case, I grabbed an eight iron. And now if I set the eight iron down the same way, you can see the white tip is now facing much closer to the flag. Using an eight iron from 100 yards is, is something you may not be used to doing, so you want to use the same philosophy you use for your wedges when you have those shorter distance. For instance, I'm gonna hit an eight iron from 100 yards, so if I make a full swing, it's way too far. 
In this case, I'm gonna judge by going back and going through about the same amount. That's how I'm gonna control the distance from 100. It'll look something like this. So to review, when the ball's above your feet, we used a lower lofted club to help reduce the amount of hook or left that the ball may go in this scenario. One other thing that'll help you, when you use a lower lofted club, you can make a more compact swing, more balanced swing, and find the center of the club face more frequently. On the other side, we sit down with the co-founder of Surf and Turf Golf to talk golf and apparel and where the golf apparel game is going. Plus, V1 Sports held their own virtual summit for the golf community. We learn about that next. How do four yards more golf tees help you gain four yards? They are frictionless. When you hit a ball from a wood tee, the ball sits inside the cup of the tee. The friction and force of the ball often breaks the tee. This creates more backspin, losing distance. Four yards more tees reduce ball spin, allowing for maximum distance. You'll love the consistent tee height and the extra four yards. Get four yards more at your golf retailer on Amazon.com or visit fouryardsmore.com. Colton caught up with Mandy Von C, Southeast Regional Sales Manager for B1 Sports to learn more about their virtual summit. Joining us from Charleston, South Carolina is the Southeast Regional Manager for V1 Sports, Mandy Von C. Mandy, appreciate you joining us. If you're paying attention on January 12th and 13th, you may have seen that V1 put together a virtual summit. What was that all about? The V1 Virtual Summit was a free online event open to the public. We hosted a variety of topics aimed at golfers and golf professionals. V1 Sports has a, a long list of powerful applications to help your golf game. Was it just purely based on one application or did you guys go into your whole lineup? No, we hosted 14 seminars, Colton. We featured our entire line of products. So there's seminars um, specifically about the V1 pressure mat, about our new V1 game and V1 coach app, and of course the V1 cameras and facility design. What were some key takeaways? What were your, some of your favorite seminars that you hosted and maybe even watched? Specifically, my two favorite seminars uh, were where I hosted with Cheryl Anderson. She is really cool watching her show off the use of her V1 pressure mat, specifically for short game. My other favorite seminar was the one that I hosted with Craig Trahan. We had just finished the facility design at Denton Country Club literally the week before. And so it was really fun to show off that project. And that specific seminar took place in the facility. So you got to see all sorts of details as far as lighting and flooring and the cameras and all the technology, of course, and the integrations that we installed. If somebody missed the virtual summit, wanted to tune in, where can they go watch it? All the videos are being posted on our YouTube channel. So go find V1 Sports YouTube channel and you can watch each seminar individually or the entire series of 14 seminars there. Mandy, you're the best, appreciate it. Thank you so much, Colton. Cheers. Surf and Turf is threading a new golf lifestyle where everybody, new golfers, young golfers, and older golfers can look good and feel good on the golf course. What's going on everybody? Very special guest is joining us here on Golf Life, the CEO and co-founder of Surf and Turf Golf, Taylor Artman. Taylor, appreciate you joining us. You know, we love Surf and Turf on Golf Life. We wear it all the time. I love the brand. How'd the brand get started? Uh, we started uh, as uh, some, you know, professional golfers and a golf professional out in Southern California. And we just felt that there was a need for a new wave of golf to come in. And that was driven around community and around you know, two things that really impacted our lives was the Tiger Woods movement that drove competitor golf, you know, skyrocketed that uh, market, brought athletes into the game, and then the newest wave would be the Top Golf push that uh, really got rid of the exclusive uh, background that golf had that you know that was deterring people away. We wanted to combine those together. You know, surf and turf golf. Everybody thinks it's it's the coasts, right? You're on either on the West Coast or the East Coast, but you guys are creating kind of this golf brand, national golf brand that can cater to everybody, including the Midwest. Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, our roots are in Southern California, but it needs to be known that everyone everywhere takes vacations and the beach is a pretty popular spot. So 
uh, the Course to Coast life is not just to those who uh, get their mail by the beach. It, everyone loves that lifestyle. You know, Taylor, what we've kind of seen is the, the small town, middle America, you know, people live on the golf course, their kids are on the golf course. You guys are giving, and even Top Golf, right? There's, there's kids that are just getting into golf, having fun at Top Golf, but you guys are giving an opportunity to kind of bring that fashion and golf in the same area. The biggest part is, is golf has always had a stigma. It's not cool, it's not fun, even though people were around it. We're gonna, you know, we're, this next wave that we are creating is gonna flip that around into where it's a welcoming atmosphere and kids are gonna enjoy it because it is cool. And so that's the surf and turf life. You know, Taylor, for the folks who haven't tried surf and turf or worn surf and turf, why should they try it? We're the next wave. Uh, the, grant, the game is growing and it's gonna take uh, new leaders to take it where it can go. And we're, the, we're that brand and we're that company. And so we're inviting you and uh, our community is gonna be one that inspires others to join us as well. So come on with it. Thanks for watching Golf Life. Be sure to check us out at golflife.com for more golf content. Plus find us on social media for more daily golf reviews and videos. And we'll see you next round.